Today we visit one of the busiest airports in SoCal, Riverside Municipal Airport. But don't take my word for it, I'll let you listen to our approach this day. Tower 9 and 157, uh, unstable reports going round, uh, circling uh, 27. November 9 157, Riverside Tower, Roger, sir, uh, say intentions. Circle back, runway 27, cancel IFR. Or 157 roger that, sir. Squawk and maintain VFR. Make left close traffic, runway 27. Oh, I see. It's I can see. Oop. Make left close traffic, runway 27. 9957. Yeah, one notch, and that's all I'm leaving. All right, three green lights down and locked. This day was pretty turbulent between the thermals and the wind, and this pilot experienced it right as he was going to land, and so he had to go around. And that doesn't include the other three aircrafts trying to come in for landing. And as you can see, there is only one runway at this airport, which makes it very congested. And one of the rules that Tower shared with us when we actually did a tour visit was that they only like to have three in the pattern because of the one runway. Technically, they do have a second runway that's almost perpendicular, but because Tower can't visually see it, they will just tell you that they can't clear you to land. You can request it and they will say landing will be at your own risk. Now you might see me doing some fast and furious braking action, but it was only because I was trying to be considerate of my fellow pilots trying to either take off or come in for landing, which of them, there were about six. Trying to get off. How's the traffic inside, 9055 Papa? November 9055 Papa, you are number two, runway 27, clear touch right. and go, on the go, make okay. left close traffic. Number two, clear two seven, on the go, make left close traffic. Nine five five zero, Papa. November one hundred three nine hundred hotel, tax the ramp via golf. Ramp via golf, three nine hotel. Runway two seven is usually the active runway, but the thing that keeps tower up at night is the ILS approach, which is zero nine. And if you do the math, you have approaching traffic converging with departing traffic. So like always, make sure to listen and follow Tower's instructions. Number 991 Tango, uniform read back, runway 27, please. Roger, runway 27, clear take out, southbound departure approved, thank you. 1999 Tango, uniform. And November 5955, Victor, uh, your uh, clearance is on request. I'm just waiting on SoCal. Okay, do we have uh, an estimate? Because if it's a longer than maybe five or bit, it's kind of departing VFR, I think. So as you can hear, you got VFR traffic trying to take off. You got IFR traffic that's been waiting. You still got people in the pattern. So it gets nuts. And of course, when we took off out of Corona, which is only four minutes away, there was nobody there. But like any time you go flying, as soon as you arrive, so does everyone else. Which I never mind because sometimes you see some pretty cool airplanes. One of the easiest landmarks to find out where transient parking is, is the terminal building, which also has a really cool second story balcony to plane watch. And on the first floor is the cafe, which has a really friendly staff and the food is delicious. You're about to witness a mistake we made when parking here. You're gonna see a visitor marking on the ground, which we assumed is where you park. It is not. You're supposed to park on either side where the numbers are. But now you don't have to make the same mistake we just did. But keep in mind, parking is only on the west side of the terminal. The east side is reserved parking. It's time for a checklist. If you found this video helpful, please like it. If you don't want to miss where we go to next, please subscribe. And even though we love our subscriptions and our likes, our main goal is to help you guys. So if you have any feedback or questions, please leave us a comment. Checklist complete. And finally, I'll leave you with, if you've never done a tower tour, Riverside is an awesome place to do a tower tour. It was so quick. It was probably the easiest one we've ever done, but you got to visit Riverside first. So make it a twofer, make it a brand new airport and a tower visit.